In this video, we will use real-world data. I strongly feel that while learning Power BI, in addition to working with mock data, working with real data is very much helpful. This allows us to explore new datasets and also effectively use Power BI functionality to the fullest. We are going to use the 311 service request data from the city of Little Rock, Arkansas, USA. We can export that as a CSV file. And also, if you uh, click on the drop down button and actions, there are various ways you can bring it by API or uh, you can access via uh, OData. We will try to use this option uh, so that uh, when we use this OData protocol, and we will uh, then search for OData in the Get Data option so that you can click on that. Once you click on that and click Connect, uh, a new uh, window will open. We can paste the URL here. Once we paste it and click OK, and uh, it will uh, bring the data into a navigator uh, like always and we can transform the data because we wanted to do send from transformations in power query so power query um, graphic uh, tool window will open up as you can see there are several uh, uh, columns probably we are not interested in some of the columns and we can do basic transformations as we uh, build uh, uh, report pages as and when needed, we can come back and uh, make additional transformations here. For now, uh, you can look at I'm um, making changes to the data types and as such. And uh, like I said, we can always come back and uh, kind of clean it more and uh, add uh, more transformations at a future date. So once we are happy, uh, whatever applied steps, like always, they will be shown on the right side uh, uh, pane. And once we are happy, it will load into uh, Power BI Desktop. So uh, this is a pretty good uh, start, I feel. And uh, once uh, we uh, start creating more uh, report pages, we will try to deep dive into the data set and understand uh, the data and answer research questions. Thanks for uh, stopping by. Uh, see you in the next video.